Here we're going to look at S-type fuses. Now, here we have the S-type. And here we have a regular fuse. You can see I'll bang, it, I'll bang the, the screw in bases here. Now, this is your normal fuse, but you can easily screw 30 amp fuses in, in the same hole as a 15. So, a lot of fire departments, and I guess, then like that. And at one time, uh, in our local area, uh, the building inspector wanted to make you put in these S-type fuses. And this is like a sleeve. You can see your regular fuse will go in there. But it's the same same base. Now, you screw this sleeve into your fuse socket. And it has a little piece of metal on here. It's like a little marm. Now that keeps it from coming out. So once you put this in, it's a pain in the mud to get out. But you can get them out because we, we then remove some of these. And you're going to use an S-type fuse in there. And it's a lot smaller of a mace to screw in there. And it just goes right in your sleeve. Now the problem is these, these, these are pretty good. They work great. But not a lot of people have S-type fuses laying around. So, and of course, the 15 amp will fit into the 20 amp socket and 20 amp will, you know, 20 amp with a 20 amp sleep. So you can't interchange 15s and 20s or screw a 30 amp in there or anything like that. But they're just not as common. And when you went to the hardware store and you needed one, these weren't around. Uh, they could have been out of them or it was late at night and uh, you didn't have any of these left. And a lot of people had these ones, you know, sitting on top of their fuse boxes, and so S-type fuse generally is a good idea, but it's just not as convenient as using a regular fuse and being responsible to only put a 15 amp fuse where a 15 amp fuse goes, or a 20 amp where a 20 amp goes. Don't put any 30s in there. If you're blowing 15s or 20s, you have to look into your wiring. And this is just pure responsibility. And this is pure my force. So, there you have it. The S type fuse, a good idea, but simply a pain in the butt. So there you have it. That's what an S-type fuse is. Do I, I'm not sure. So I, I don't usually carry S-types on me. But I always have these at the mountings. So I always make sure the right ones get in the right spots. But if you have tenants that are changing out your 15s or 20s for 30s, uh, this is probably a good idea. Although, you better have some of these on hand. Otherwise, you're going to be making special trips for your S-type fuses. 